less than a month ago and my marathon is all planned. After a bit of experimenting and narrowing down routes that were too hilly, I finally found a route I'm happy with. At 11am on 10th October, I'll be starting outside of Hollywood Bowl, Norwich, and then following the A147 and alongside the real Wensum, which will lead me to my first mile marker. contain a few road crosses that could be difficult depending on traffic conditions but will take me along from St Crispin's Road till it joins Marriott's Way. just be following Marriott's way for several miles as it passes out of the city towards Drayton. The reason I'm coming out along Marriott's way is because it's lovely and flat and very popular amongst cyclists and runners. Forgetting there's a beautiful track to run down and there's no cars so it'll be lovely and peaceful for me to clock up the miles. After I've reached my sixth mile, I'm going to be reaching Drayton, at which point I'm going to turn around and head back to Norwich via Marriott's Way, essentially doing my route in reverse. back along Marriott's way, back towards Hollywood Bowl, where well, my main hope is that the traffic doesn't hold me up too much and that I've maintained a steady pace so that I can keep up for the rest of the marathon. As 
I reach the train station, I'll be continuing round with the A147 until I get to the football stadium, at which stage I'll then join Wherry Road and head back to Hollywood Bowl. Some of you are going to be saying that's only 13 miles and therefore only a half marathon. Well that's because I've chosen for this to be a two lap marathon, meaning I'm going to be doing with all the same elements again. The conditions on the foot will be constantly changing so I need to make sure I'm paying attention to it so that I don't run into difficulties. So with all these plans in place, hopefully I'll be able to complete my extremely hard challenge. But I've got to remember my run is different to any other marathon, in that I'm not going to have people on my route supporting me and cheering me on, so I've got to be a lot more motivated than myself to keep going. But if you want help with my motivation, then please do consider donating to my Just Giving. Or if you just want to be kept up to date on how I'm doing, please do follow my channel or my Instagram where I'll keep you all up to date. Thank you.